This morning, the Insurance Institute for Highway Safety is putting more cars to the test, and for the first time, small electric cars are being compared to other small vehicles. Jeff Pegues is in Washington, where the new results show a lot of room for improvement. Jeff, good morning. Good morning. The results were not good for half of the cars tested. The IHS crashed 12 small cars like this one to mimic how the cars react in a crash, the side of the cars react in a crash if they hit a pole or a tree at 40 miles per hour. With more small cars on the roads, consumers want to know if they are safe. Of the dozen cars tested by the Insurance Institute for Highway Safety, only one of them earned a good rating in the small overlap front crash test, the Mini Cooper Countryman. IIHS's Joe Nolan conducted the research. This space is for you, the driver, and you want that space to be well maintained in a crash, even a severe crash. This space up in the front is sacrificial. This is designed to absorb energy, absorb crash forces, and do it in a way that doesn't impinge on you. The electric-powered Chevrolet Volt earned an acceptable rating in the test. But according to the IIHS, other small cars didn't adequately protect the driver. The Fiat 500L, the Nissan Juke, the electric-powered Nissan Leaf were all poor performers. At the bottom of the list was the Mazda 5. The IIHS says the car struggled because of a host of structural and restraint system problems. Your occupant compartment is there to protect you. In these vehicles, the compartment itself collapses from the forces of the crash. In response to the poor showing, Mazda told us its vehicle received the Institute's top rating of good in the frontal moderate overlap and roof strength tests, while the Chrysler Group says the Fiat 500L continues to offer a high level of protection. Nissan says it's proud of the Jukes and the Leafs rating in other IIHS tests. They also tested the batteries in those electric powered cars. They say they did not find any fire related issues in the batteries for the Chevy Volt as well as the Nissan Leaf. Nora. All right, Jeff, thank you.